Getting served. There's another whole world once you get that street and you ain't in the tourism role in terms of what's going on in them kind of countries. And there's, they will show you that in the inflection of the authenticity of the culture and them at the same time serving you as a tourist. So we have to educate our kids to know the history, be able to articulate the history, and become good docents to an international market who wants to understand better the authentic culture of the great migration experience where half a million people migrated out of it. And, and it ain't just in Chicago. We came up the three, the South Coast, the West Coast, and the East Coast into those cities, right? And you saw this, you see it in every city. You see the same game being played in terms of the, the, the I mean, I, the 10th anniversary paper of the, uh, the Black Panther Party. Little bitty pictures this big. You open the paper one time, right? Then you open the paper a second time, like this, and you have a little bitty pictures. That 10th anniversary of all the people that were assassinated under the Compton Tempo, putting down that movement. And from there, we went undercover. Mm -hmm. We ran, literally. I ostracized ourselves, mm -hmm. created a classism scenario. Mm -hmm. Street brothers remain street brothers. The, the, the small bourgeois classes who were willing to compromise the interests of the bat masses in our community profited from that reality. So you have today a scenario where you have young people who have no sense of history. No. Even through the street gangs, now you've got the, the 17 and 18 year old with the bag and the, and the Mac 10. No guidance. With no guidance and no leadership mm -hmm. in terms of that institution. So how do we restore the black man to head household? Right? Mm -hmm. we, in a, we live in a matriotic society. Can we admit that? Right? How many strong brothers do you see standing around? Mm -hmm. Like that's the price we are paying for the culture of corruption that dominates this town and has dominated for the last hundred years, all the way back from Hanky Dean Kent, Kent, all the way through the Irish that run the town. They got here first. They hooked up Tammany Hall, New York, every major city in this country, that same pattern. If we don't break that cycle, if we don't get the next generation ready to step into the entrepreneurial opportunities, I am very proud of the fact that there are 1,500 young people in the Conrad Hilton as we speak, and that Mr. Graves has been able to pass his legacy down to his son. And I'm an old man, we're old men. We're trying to make sure that we are plugging into the next generation so that they know the lessons that we provide so that they won't make those same mistakes Absolutely. along their path to economic emancipation. Bottom line, economic emancipation, if you ain't hearing that in the conversation, what is it about? So, uh,